Hello everyone, it's Yolanda Renee and today we are going to be doing a natural hair tutorial with Taylor and of course our favorite kids line, Eden Body Works Kids. Hey guys, it's me Taylor and this is my old twist out. It's kind of cute but it's really messy but we're going to turn it into this hairstyle. This trend is called Skinny Fat Braids, so we decided to try this out. And here are the products we're going to be using today. But first, we're going to make our first part. And this section is going to be a skinny braid. We're going to be doing two skinny braids and then doing a fat braid. So go ahead and tie the rest of the hair so it's out of the way. And here is how we're layering the products. You start with the detangling spray that will really loosen up the curls. And then we're gonna add the Berry Curly Cream. This is our moisturizer and our styling product. Next, we're gonna detangle that section. You can start with finger detangling, and then once that's done, go in with a detangling comb or a brush. The third product is actually the Smoothing Gel, and we use this just on her edges. Now we're ready to start braiding. I always take a little section in the front and then split that into three sections. And then I just start braiding, which is very hard to explain, but I mean, if you know how to braid, then braid with me, girl. <laughs> but if you don't, you just have to keep practicing. It's so hard to get this technique shown properly like in a tutorial. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to finish out this braid and then we're going to move on to the next skinny braid. All right, so now we're starting our next section, which I'm making this one extra skinny. So the first one was a skinny braid, but this one's gonna be like super thin, okay? And you just basically just follow the same pattern that you started with. I guess this is kind of like a zigzag part. All right, so we're gonna layer the products in the same order, the detangling spray, the curly cream, and then the smoothing gel. As you can see, these two products, the detangling spray and the curly cream, really work so well together. Look at her curls. You can actually see her hair transform like right before your eyes. I just love this combo and it works just as good on Skylar's hair who has 4C hair but it really makes her curls pop as well.
right, so now it's time to make our fat braid. <laughs> so this time we're just gonna go straight back. We're not gonna do the zigzag part. Um, and of course we're gonna do the same layering process as far as the products and finger detangle and then go in with the detangling comb or brush. <laughs> Now braiding a larger section is a bit difficult, especially with our curly hair and because our hair is product damp. So it's very important to detangle as you go. You can use your fingers to finger detangle or if it's too tangled, then go ahead and use a brush. So you would just stop and hold it with one hand and then of course brush with the, the free hand. And detangling as you go is very, very important because that helps with the neatness of the braid. If your hair is super tangled, but you're still braiding, then you're gonna have a frizzy braid. So make sure your hair is super detangled. All right, so we did the same thing on each side. It's identical. Next, we're gonna do a skinny braid on the other side of each of these fat braids. Once you're done with those, the center section, we are gonna do three braids. So this is the pattern you'll want, and you're gonna start doing one braid, and you're gonna stop in the middle, do the other braid, and then you're gonna crisscross these together. Once you're done with the two center braids, which are the skinny braids, you're gonna crisscross those and then do one big gigantic fat braid down the center. So as you can see here, I lost some of the footage, y'all don't hurt me, but hopefully you get the idea. Um, and we're just gonna lay her edges with the smoothing gel, which is perfect to lay your edges, especially kids' edges, cause girl, <laughs> I don't know about my edges, but it works for Taylor and Skye. And we're using a soft bristle brush to kind of, you know, make some little designs. Nothing too crazy. Finally, I'm using some Alake Naturals Essential 17 Hair Growth Oil on her scalp. And this is the final look. Hopefully we get some good shots for you so you can get the idea of the look. I know I missed some of the footage so it may be a little bit confusing. Um, but hopefully this helps you guys out and maybe you'll try this for a protective style for your little one. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. And if you continue to watch this whole tutorial, you're going to be so happy because I have a surprise for you guys. So stay tuned. to win some of these Eating Kids products.
follow, share, and comment to enter this giveaway. More details in the description box. Good luck, everyone. And if you're eager to get your hands on some Eating Kids products now, don't forget, use my coupon code to save $5.